What is up everybody? This is me, Philip the Legendary Gamer, back at you with another video. And in this uh video, uh we're doing the off season work and week one. And well this is the team before uh this is the team currently. We have a D it says at quarterback. I don't know why. Our offensive line's looking good. I want to improve a muff tackle and right guard. Maybe I don't really know. But receivers great. JK's really good. Uh, defensively, um, pretty good. Safeties would need some work. AJ Terrell up to super set. Um, Miles Garrett's good. D line's disgusting. Uh, obviously, we have some regression. But specialists, we have Jason McCordy. Number in free agency. But I will see y'all in the first week of free agency. See y'all there. What is up, everybody? And we're back in free agency uh, week one. Uh, week one of free agency. We have Kyle Juszczyk as the best kicker. What? It's just special teams. What? What is this free agency? No one. It's. I guess it's because of the... It's a fantasy draft. That's a really good reason. Tom Brady's down to a 92. We need a backup for him. We just start a little backup. I'm going to scroll to the bottom. Trace McSorley is an option for sure. That down bad. We have a lot of money. He's a valuable receiver. Are you sure about that? If one of our receivers get injured. That's all the offers I'm making. Because really there's no one else. Kyle, you check. I won't be using a lot. And I need to change the playbook a little maybe. But we got upgrades actually. And our passing defense was second to last. We just have a lot of... Okay, we have Jamar, AJ. No one else really. Jamar Chase, we're going to put some slot on him. And that's going to bump him up. Three plus catching. That's really good. Uh, AJ Terrell is going to get slot too. Actually, no, I'm going to put a zone on him. I run a lot of zone. Oh, that's a lot of upgrades. That's really good. He got a plus one speed. His ratings are disgusting. His zone coverage up is playing at a 96 with it. He's really probably one of the best corners in the league right now. He's a shutdown corner. He's a Darrell Revis 2.0. Now, we're going to try to make some trades to improve our line and our safeties. Yeah. Now, Kellen Mond, this actually could happen in real life. Kellen Mond could go to the Patriots. He does have, let's see what he did, but his stats. He's playing up. All right, he's doing pretty well. His stats are not bad. Now, Tom, uh, every season, I think I'm going to bump up the, in, I'm going to bump up the injury a little this season. Now, he had a, he was one for two, 17 yards. Now, that's not bad. Rushing did not. He rushed for a touchdown. Two attempts, one yard. Not bad. Not good, though. He went backwards on one, though. So, maybe it was just a sack. General. Now, I'm definitely looking at this. Definitely. Okay. Now, I think I'm going to try to get Kellen Mond with some linemen. No. They have a really good defense. Now, do they have safeties? They have a Justin Simmons for me. Yes, I will take that. Now, they do want a QB. Go Gardner Minshew. I do not play good with him. That's there. That is there. Now we have no draft picks. And that's official. Jalen Thompson, welcome to the squad. 
Now, Kareem, is anyone going to be interested in him? Nah. No one's interested in him, so. I'll see y'all when I can get a trade to work. All right, see. Actually, no. Cameron Curl is a stud, too. Let's see. This one has nobody. But a draft pick could definitely increase this. We're just getting rid of our draft picks. And that's so close. Maybe we want to give them. Okay, but. Alright, I'll see y'all when I make the trade. What is up? And we got the trade to work, so I think our team is in business. Now, I will be scouting for a young fifth round stud, I guess. Or, like, I don't know what draft picks we have. I will look for a stud in the draft for, like, a steal later in the rounds. But I'll see y'all uh, on draft day. I'm just going to make a bunch of free agent signings and stuff that don't really matter on camera. See y'all on draft day. See y'all there. What is up? And we're back at you at draft day, on draft day. And there is this young stud I see. He's, like, 21. He is huge. He's crazy athletic. And his hit power looks pretty good. It looks like a serious rusher. All right, so he, we're gonna try to find a replacement for Blake Cashman. All these undrafted comes Victor. Prophecy is true. Victor Joseph, apparently, uh, he's uh from Texas A&M, my, my favorite school ever. Now, if we look at his physicals. He did not run the best 40 yet, I know. He's not crazy athletic. Maybe he just had a bad combine. He is strong. Look at the college pro day look like. This just shows. His pro day was way better. He ran faster. He did more reps. Well, the first day of reps, well, I looked at everybody's scouting physicals, and they're their combine was so bad. And then their pro day, everybody averaged like 10 plus reps more. I'm like, what? Unless it's like one of the weaker like kickers. Now, I saw his power move was A. His hit power looked good because he looks strong. You just feed the... It says always look for the massive hit. Always looks to intercept passes. Motor is always running hot. Often looks to rip ball from runners. Known to attract flags. Love to spin as a counter move. Relies on swift arm over arm over move. Uses speed to power to bull rush blockers. That that's pretty good for his player notes. And he's like a day three projection. That's sick. I I think I traded up for a fifth round pick. We had no picks this. Here, so we got a fifth round pick. And I know I'm gonna draft them. And Blake Cashman is a 74, I think. So we gotta set the bar to 70, 70 overall. I think that's what I'm thinking. 67 to 70 overall would be amazing. For like, I think he was the sixth round, 29th pick projection. When I looked at him, it says day three, obviously though. We we basically are still getting the same player. We're getting the same player. We're just trading down like a couple picks. We traded down one pick for a free seventh round pick. Oh wait, no. Okay, no. We traded down 10 picks for a free seventh round. And we're gonna get the same guy either way, probably. I don't think anyone selected him yet. So, uh, this is gonna be one of my longer videos. 30 to 35 minutes. Obviously the game's gonna be about 15 to 20 minutes, then free agency with all the cutting I'm gonna do is gonna be about 15 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes. Oh. Uh, okay, I wanna see, I want to auto-draft here. I want him to be auto-drafted. Because I think we just made a big mistake. Okay, I'll see you when uh, we get to preseason week one so I can trade for him. See y'all there.
What is up, everybody? It's me back uh, at the trade, and I think we just got a steal. And anyways, he was drafted 12th overall in the fifth round by the Tennessee Titans, and we just got a steal there. Now, what I'm going to do is put him and Blake Cashman in a battle through the preseason. And I will see y'all in the buy at the end of the Raiders game at the end of the preseason. See y'all there. I forgot to mention he has hidden dev, and also I want y'all to see his revenge game versus the. Oh, we lost to the t Titans, but versus the Titans, but we lost to the Dolphins badly. But it's preseason, so not everything really matches up. We'll see this, and we lose by three. Now we're gonna let's see what happens. Like overall, how both players played and also I'm gonna count how much snaps they did basically who did better overall from the for the amount of stat snaps he got now if we him here still get to see it now Ronnie Harrison first in ta total tackles second in like solo tackles now someone got three picks Shaq got eight sacks in three games well, probably because the blockers are backups, just making him, and these stats are not realistic. Tom Brady obviously didn't play that much. We'll, we'll see how Kellen did. Kellen threw three picks. He threw exactly how Haynes King did in the first game. But Kellen threw two tutties. Like, can't go wrong with that. And he did run okay. Uh, but we're looking for the defense, yes. Now. He had 14 tackles, one tackle for a loss for a sack, and on 186 downs. Not bad. Now let's see how Mr. Blake did. He had eight tackles, all solo, two catches allowed, 65 downs. Honestly, I don't know if Blake Cashman's the dude, you know? We're going to add him to the trade block. We're going to see. And Victor just won the battle. So we'll see what trades come in on week one seal there. What is up, guys? And honestly, I do think this is a trade worth it. Uh, I'll let you all look at it. Uh, Blake's not going to be playing much. He made some good plays last year, but he was not really a big contributor. And I've been, I wanted to get rid of him since week one. He was just there because I couldn't find a replacement. That fat in our, like, lineup. That was going to fit in our lineup. So, obviously, we want to look to the Super Bowl. We improved our team. We had no downgrades. Neither did other teams. Our overall stayed the same. Besides our defense, I'm not going to do this stuff stuff it that's just really usually whenever I it just wastes time to me trade accepted I can ignore yeah, the, but you offered the trade if I'm accepting it yeah they're gonna accept it but I'll see y'all in the game see y'all there Whoosh. okay guys we're back in the game and I'm just gonna sing this part um but anyways if Tom Brady does I put the injury up by five uh injury rating uh, like chances to get injured. If Tom Brady gets injured, then he probably it's either his last or second last season. The last season. He usually plays uh two extra season. Oh, Jacoby Myers starting the season with a blast. He's gonna take it to the house. Jacoby Myers, yes sir. Yes, sir. Now we are going to. No, they got through. How did they get through? Uh, Stephon too, it's injured now. Yeah, okay, this is not really going good on defense. Joseph is a stud. We just need to build. Yeah, like, no, left outside linebackers. There can be only one. What? Yep, that's me. Okay. See y'all in the next drive. All right. All right, boys, we're back, and we're running the same play to Jacoby Myers. 
just because he's a stud. Are you sure about I that? I think this could be his year. Obviously, with plays like this, he's already got like a 90, he's got 99 yards. Now, Joseph, if you could get the sack here, it'd be great. Getting some pressure there. All right, now they're going to punt it. And I will see y'all in the fourth quarter. See y'all there. Okay, guys, we're back in the fourth and in the fourth quarter. If they, this is a really big opportunity for a defense. Come on, get him! Get him down! So this could be something. We can return this to the house if we want to for the lead. That'd be the better scenario. And they get it though. That's how it's gonna be. Who is that? Who is that receiver? Alright. Three point lead here they have. We're going to go in the position of Thomas. Now I do want to see here. Come on, run it, run it. Oh, he got hit hard. Twenty-five yards on that day. Good job, Tom. Now the worst case scenario for the first three weeks is if he tears something. I think he missed a leg. ACL. Get up, Knox. Get up and get the ball. Oh my gosh. Alright. Uh, this game is probably lost. And this game is probably going to be lost. Yes, it's going to be lost. By us. So, we're going to go. Put in our young quarterback named Kellen Mond. Just so we don't want to risk so we don't risk Brady getting hurt and he's gonna we're gonna lose this game most likely. I just wanna I'm gonna try to win it obviously still, but not with Brady. Number thirteen, Kellen Mond's out here. And we got Harrison Bryant on a good pass there. That was a bright slot. I mean, the chances of us winning are pretty low, but it's not, not, it's not impossible. Now, Chase could get open here, and I'd, I'd love him. All right, Chase, come on. That was so bad. That was really bad pass. Now, Kyle Mullen doesn't have the throw power. He has 88 throw power, which isn't going to cut it much. Come on, Chase Claypool. Now, hurry up, hurry up, run, hurry up. I have to take a shot. Right. Come on, take a shot. Okay. He can break stacks. That's what we need. Alright, come on. Um, we're gonna run. I know we're gonna lose this. We're gonna run. We're gonna take it deep. Chase? No. Oh, no. Right, at least stop the clock, though. Now, the dagger play does work often with me. Crosser routes do. Yeah. Going to give this to Chase. And he drops it. So we're just gonna, you know, take some shot. Take a shot to Chase Claypool. Now Emmanuel. And it's picked, but not picked. All right, Kellen Mon is not the answer. He is a good quarterback, but I will see y'all at the end of the game. See y'all there. What is up, everybody? And we're back, and I've decided to play the next game. Are you sure about that? It's Jamal Adams, obviously. Oh, calm down, Jamal. They always draft it. Some of these teams are just drafting players that are already on their team in real life. But I'll see y'all in the game. See y'all there. Wait. Y'all no, never mind. The Cardinals are the only ones. Our division sucks right now. See y'all in the next video. I mean, not the next video, the game, sorry. What is up? And we're back in the game, and we need to put Kellen Mon in. I will 150 yards plus oh, one, two touchdowns and no interceptions and a 60 plus or 50 plus completion percentage rating will get you something. We'll get a lot of respect and maybe some more starts later on in the season. Like, 
if we if we clinch a playoff spot, Kellen's gonna start a lot. If we miss a playoff spot, Kellen's gonna start a lot. And we had the delay of me. Yes, of course. That was not Kellen's fault. That was my fault. That was just me talking, not knowing what the clock was at. It's definitely on me. Now that's he's speedy. He's got some wheels. He almost fit that in. That was that was really good bullet pass actually. The velocity on that was very fast. Now, well, that's intercepted. Yeah, that's not me. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, that was a bad pass. Yes, it was. Yes, it. Yeah, that was a bad pass. At the same time, that was a really bad read by me. I made a very bad read throwing it to Jamal Adams. Who do they have? Michael Thomas and Deshaun. It's a controversial team. Especially since you also have. Did they have Chris Carson standing? And you got Jamal Adams and Mr. Thomas. Or no, Miles Garrett got for another sack. And then a rookie got the sack. Half a sack. Yeah, that's good. We have some bright spots on the defense for sure. Oh. He pressured him. Oh my gosh, Caleb Forley just said hello to Mr. Williams, I think. Oh, it was a really bad pass, and Ronnie Harrison picks him back up. That was a loss of 10. There's no way you hit this. McPherson. Okay, I thought our kick, the kicker, McPherson, was in the back there. Yes. You had length there. You were just left, onto the left. That was just bad accuracy. Okay, we have not run it, uh, ran it a lot lit, Mr. Dobbins. So we're going to cut in so outside. That's a good eight-yard rush. All right, so... JK was good last week, and I wasn't, I didn't even know. All right, we're going to run the reverse here. Um, audible chase on a streak. Our playbook has a lot of deep routes. That's a bad read. He cut. Why did Chase Claypool run this way? See, like, I don't like how he's playing right now. Bro, pass it. I was trying to pass it to Mr. Bryant. I accidentally pump faked it, and I tried to unpump fake it, and then I accidentally threw it to Chase. Wait, we got him, and that's well, down to the floor. Now, I think we're gonna go for a touchdown here on the ground. Kill him on into the end zone, rushing touchdown for the young stud. All right. All right, so let's see here. We got Mr. Joseph. It's so weird to see Deshaun Watson in a jersey on the Seahawks jersey, and we get a pick. And it's real. I got lost in my own words. And now Cameron Curl has two picks, and so does AJ Terrell. Oh, we're having a pick fest. One today already. A pick fest, really. Like, it's really a pick fest. Oh, we had four yesterday on Patty Mahomes. Their running game must have been really good. Now we got Chase again. Whoop. Oh, that was really bad. I'm so bad at juking and Madden. Now we got Jacoby. Okay, I hate when I try to quick snap it like, and I'm spamming it, and I throw it to A. Oh, I almost did it again. Oh, get sacked. There was no blocking there. Shaquille, Shaq Griffin. All right, Mr. One Hand. I'm just, I'm sad. Life is sad. Now we're gonna test his clutch ability, his clutch play ability. Someone guard Mr. Mr. Shaq. We have Mike on Wendy on him. Okay, that's good blocking on him. Now we got him. 
That was a late throw, like a really late throw. That's on me. Kellen's not throwing very well, though. His start ability, if the chance he gets, he's, his starting like ability is probably 40% right now. How he's playing with us. All right, Brandon Linder. All right, it's this drive, and we'll play one drive after this. And then, wait, yeah, this is our last drive, I think, yeah. That we're gonna show for the first half. All right, Mama's Gary gets another sack. Four sacks already. This isn't preseason. All right, we're gonna use her, DG. Got the flats. It was a wheel route. Okay. Fourth down. Now, if they punt it, yes, they will. I will see you in the next, uh, I'll see you in the fourth quarter. See y'all there. What is up, everybody? And Callan Mon apparently has been doing good because, well, uh, the Seahawks just scored, by the way. So, we got Harrison Bryant, and that's roughing the passer. Yeah, we had pressure right in our face. It's holding? Holding! Really, you're going to do that to us? They're gonna accept the penalty. What? Oh yeah, they're they're not accepting it. Evans up the middle. Did he get it? No, he did not. That is devastating. Oh, we have the two minute warning to help us here. Miles Garrett, I need you to get in the zone. If you're deadly when you get in the zone. He's already deadly! Oh, no, he roughed the pass or I thought he didn't throw it away. A rookie. He did draw flags. Apparently he does. Oh, and it wastes the two-minute warning. Oh, we need a pick. Like, we need to pressure him hard. So, Garrett. Garrett does good. You good. No? Let's call I'm going to let him score. Okay. going to let him score. We need to let him score. Snap the ball. All right, we hold the time out here. We're going to be left with very little time to get down. All right, come on, come on, I don't want to lose. This was a great performance by Kellen. All right, come on, quick time out. Good hits there by our linebackers. we to play some zones though, we're still playing zone. It's a pass, it's a pass for sure. You got to not let this through. Let him score, let him score, let him score. All right, thank you. Now we have one minute and one timeout to get downfield. And score a two point conversion and a touchdown. All right, so. So we can go to overtime, yes. Now, Kellen Mon, really. It was the challenge, and I said I would. Get to the line quick. We're going to take a shot a little bit. Yes, Dad, this place is so good. coverage oh Jamar Chase oh my gosh I'm not doing so we're gonna run for the win we got it I love you Evans okay like that was insane. Like, I was going to throw it to Jacoby, and then I saw Chase running deep and Jamal pulling away from him. And I was like, thank you very much. Oh, that's so amazing. Now it's 35-35. It was a score of for a second there. 27-28. Come on. 
Come on, Garrett. I need you to rush. This is why we got you in the draft. To get plays done. They're calling timeouts, so they're going to try to set up a field goal. Wasting another timeout, then they're gonna not be able, they're not gonna be able to pull off a field goal, I don't think. Unless they get out of bounds. Wait, they're gonna let the clock run out. They're so smart there. Alright, come on. Alright, we're gonna call time out. Cody Perky is a former pro bowler. Okay, miss it, please. Come on. had a disgusting fourth quarter but it wasn't disgusting enough oh my heart was just like my heart just dropped and then we win all right we win the toss kellen mott are you clutch enough are you clutch enough are you clutch mr kellen please tell me you are Turn that. Right, we gotta have possession catches here. Possession. No dirt. No place that do not need to be thrown. Remember, play is safe, Philip. Well, I accidentally threw it, but Jamar Chase. Oh, my hand keeps slipping. He's throwing two ints receptions. One was on me though. Jamar Chase is going crazy today. He just got over two. He got eight receptions, two touchdowns, two hundred sixteen yards. Oh. Ha, ha, ha. What are you doing, Jamal Adams? Jamal, you're just standing there staring at my players. Kellen Mond might be a startable quarterback. Now, I'm not going to start him over Tom Brady. But, like, oh, we may get Chase Claypool for the second time. And he got hit, yes. But now, you know, I said this before. If we do clinch a playoff spot, Kellen's going to start the rest of the games. If we miss a playoff spot, he's going to start the rest of the games. So, he's going to start some games after this. But if Ke uh, Tom does get injured, I won't be as mad about it. That's obviously going to be the video title if he gets injured, but, yeah. Kellen's getting reps in, and that's what matters. So. Now we're going to have to run this for Kellen. No, we're not. We're going to have to throw it to Jacoby Myers, and he's breaking tackles, getting into the 30-yard line. Now, Kellen Mond's making some safe throws, making some good reads there. Now, I had a feeling that was going to get stripped. <laughs> that was scary. Screen pass. Come on. You got to work here. Screen pass is working. Yeah, it will. He's so tired right now. Sean Evans. We're gonna stop running. Hurry up here for a second. We're gonna run it with McPherson, our third string running back. What happened to Jake? Joe Thunny absolutely just got body. He has three rushes on the day. Why? Why does he have that much? Kill him. Come on. Run, boy. Run. Alright. We're four yards away. 34. Side down, easy enough, right? Oh, well, I hope. All right, we're going. We're going. It's this. You get this, or you don't get it. You know. Do we get that? We just got that. Oh my gosh! Two minute warning. All right, the Seahawks fans are just like. 
<sighs> All right, this is great. Now we are very backed up, so remember, interceptions can happen. Fumble. We recovered our own fumble. Oh my gosh, that was definitely a heart attack almost. <laughs> Gotta play. I'm gonna go Red Sun Sisters. We got Chase. Chase dropped it! Alright, now we have to take a little bit of a shot here. Gonna take her a little bit. Oh, that was almost picked. Alright, we're gonna take our three. We're gonna take our three. I'm gonna sim this three and I'm just gonna play the defense. Let's see. We hit the field goal. Brett Maher is the GOAT. There's no doubting that. He just got us game winning points, possibly. They have two timeouts. We have two timeouts. So, could still, they still should come back. Alright, we. Kill Harry. Kind of. I don't know how I feel about it. Good. Down, under. Now, all right, he's at the 40. They need to get to the 38 for Cody to hit it. That's where they were right before OT. He missed it. Cody's had a rough day today. Oh, you just slammed them. Watch it. Great tackle! Great tackle by a rookie! And a great hit on the lineman. And how is that a first down? Like, how is that a first down, really? Like, even the deal's that bad. Oh. How do you let that happen? Wait, he may not have time. He's going to let it run out. there all right guys obviously this video really took about 15 minutes 50 minutes to film i'm gonna be cutting about 30 minutes up 25 minutes of it yeah. but anyways please subscribe subscribe please like it means a lot to me i celebrate every subscriber when i got 12 subscribers i'm an aggie fan 12th man you know just like the seahawks yes but like i was so happy like i was celebrating now, that was a crazy performance from Kellen. And our running backs went crazy. JK died because he was injured. Literally, he died. Yes, he had a fumble, but it didn't affect him. McPherson is a rookie. Now, Jamar went crazy today. And so did Chris Evans. Chris Evans is going to be going crazy for more days to come. All right. But defensively... Sacks. Shaq. Shaquem Griffin killed us. Now, Miles Garrett did really good in that too, and I just. Victor Joseph should have got two other sacks. Yeah. He's just dead, tired. Now, he's definitely a guy we're going to build on. Now, Mr. Brett Maher was 3 for 3 on field goals. Good job to you. And Cody Farkey was 2 for 4. And that gave us the win. All right. Thank you. Please subscribe. I really, like, it means a lot to me. And like the video and ring the bell so you never miss whenever I upload. I upload a lot. It'll be a summer. And I'll see you in my next video. See you all there.